Um, all right, here we go, right guys. Now on we have side, we, have, guys? we got Hack on the first player side as Ryu. Uh -huh. and we have Noel Brown on the second player side, probably as a guy. Yeah, probably as a guy. Yeah, yeah, there you go. There you go. Tell me he likes this matchup, so. Wow, so he's a cigar player that actually likes this matchup. You know what I wish that? I wish they had the grass stage, like they had an alpha. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So these guys could fight there. That, that'd be like an epic bout. That, that, that was, was one of the first team. times where, like, you know, these two guys really had, like, a nice, like, sentimental story thing going on. Yeah, I like definitely. That about, I like that about the alpha series. Yeah, man. Like, too bad Sagat is, like, you know, the the king in this game. <laughs> Apparently, Ryu will probably be the king in the next game. So We'll see, man. He's got some serious nerves to his PCs, it. so. Yeah, he does. And we have a missed combo from Sagat. Um, plasma chucking has started. <laughs> you know, it's getting thrown, but Noel Brown is doing good with meter management. Yeah, he is. Keeping more meter than your opponent is so important in this match. Definitely, because uh, Saget's EX Tigers are a lot better against Riot than Riot's EX Fireballs are against Saget. And both these players have an incredibly important DPF ADC. Yep. Having two bars when you need them is gonna, mm, yes. it, it makes a difference. I and mean, although Saget doesn't do full damage in the corner in the air, yes, it's well. Not in the air right now. Oh, I mean, in the corner right now. <laughs> yeah, that's all good. And Ryu has survived, and not for long. And uh, well, we all knew that was coming. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, as a second player, I can see you know where the focus is from Noel. He uh, definitely wants to keep a strong lead in the meter. Now we saw a trade trade DP coming from Hack right there, and he elected not to use his EX. Right yeah, I would have used. I mean, I mean, you, you want to use it? I would have used it because I wanted to knock him down and take a little bit more life. You know, every little bit counts, especially against the guy. Okay. And uh, uses use the Tiger knee follow up to send Hack all the way into the corner. Uh, Noel tried to focus there and paid for it. And there's Next that level. meter management. That he had a DP. It landed, but he did not quite have two meters. So yeah, he, he did not get that level two ultra. And uh, we have a guess ultra, but uh. All right, I'll turn and return. Ryu is stuck there, grabbing for Sagat's balls, and that's what you get. You get a knee in the face. Apparently, Sagat might get his revenge this time around. <laughs> no. The thing about this matchup is, though, I think it relies on who has the lead, you know? Whoever has the lead has the advantage in this matchup, particularly, because it's a fireball war most of the time, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, so you gotta set the tone early. As far as damage, I think Sagat has the, the advantage. Well, actually, I know Sagat has the advantage. It's just the right player can't make many mistakes, you know? Right, right. He has to be very safe and conservative of his meters. Like, this guy's wasting a lot of meters. I think he should, like, conserve a lot of more of them. Just relax on the meters. Like, we see that from Japanese players all the time, that they throw fireballs that might not be the best fireballs. Yeah, exactly. they build a meter while they're doing it, and that's right. important. They, they always look at their bar, you know? They're looking at the time in the bar. That's what they look at. And those are the two most important things when you're fighting, you know? Your energy, you know, that's that's always going to be there. But as far as you keep your meter management and play safe. That was a good bait. There we go. Hack succeeds in making Noel wow. earn those two bars. And all of a sudden, okay. Yeah, well. Now, this is the position that Sega does not like to be in in the corner. Uh, that was a very good uh, jump in Hurricane Kick. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Wow. Oh my goodness. He managed to get the DP out the second time he tries. <laughs> hey. That was a good, smart decision right there. First the round of second game goes to Hack. <laughs> Where's Hack from? Uh, I don't know, but I've seen him at Battlefield Arcadia several times. Now. Oh, really? Yes. Always playing Ryu. I've seen him before, too. I just didn't know like, where he's from and stuff. He's a uh, pretty okay player. I, I think he uh, likes Ryu a lot. You know, I can tell he, he really wants to win with the character the way he plays. So <laughs> yeah. a lot of force into his moves. Heck, using um, using an FADZ after a fireball to create some pressure. Oh, oh my goodness! That and took no a lot says, of damage. Let me show you how to use FADZ <laughs> after a fireball. Let me show you. No oh no, FADZ into ultra there. Noel Brown gets away with that nonsense. <laughs> and it's right, match no, point for Noel. Now they both have a pretty good amount of meters. Uh, it's gonna come down to who uses it better right now. I don't think Sagat really necessarily needs to use his meter right now. Oh. That's right. He chose, the, he chose to fill up the rest Let of the super. second super. Oh, wow. Oh, Tiger Genocide? I, <laughs> I haven't seen that super since, like, <laughs> CBS. <laughs> <laughs> he actually used second super. Oh, wow. Oh, Should have been EX Pancake yeah, into Ultra. E that was a very bad decision. It's but really great. More real players need to do that. Yeah. I mean, it, you know, I, I guess oh, I wasn't really thinking about it at the time. This is very close. Oh, oh, man, stop man. guessing, man. A very good match. Noel Brown takes it. There you go. 
You know, if Noel Brown lost that because he used the super, I would have laughed. <laughs> I would be rolling right now. <laughs>